Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope you've already subscribed to my channel and I'm so thankful for all the love that you have showered on me so far. So I'm sure by looking at the thumbnail, you must be aware by now what I'm going to talk about. So today I've created a makeup kit under 2000 for beginners. So this makeup kit includes everything. I mean, literally everything. So here is the box. I ordered a lot of stuff from Nika on this season sale so i am going to show you all that's in this box and then you can also create your makeup kit i will drop the link down there and you can go ahead and purchase everything that i have in inside this one i think it was very difficult to create a kit under 2000 rupees you know considering i cannot compromise on the quality of products that i'm going to offer to you people so i have used two specific brands in creating this kit one is swiss beauty and another is inside cosmetics i have used these brands on certain levels in the past but creating an entire kit was really something new of an experience to me and i have put my whole heart in creating this one so i hope you guys will like okay it. guys so to start with i've got my phone over here where i have mentioned all the prices and i will tell you the prices as so i to go. start with i have got this pore minimizer primer from insight which costed me 110 rupees and this primer is just magical i have seen youtubers rant about it and when i used it i actually knew why people were ranting so moving on, I have this uh, Insight Professional HD Foundation. This foundation costed me about 235 rupees. And this does the work very decently. I mean, it doesn't get cakey. You have to definitely blend it well in order to get that, you know, seamless finish. But for the price that you're paying, this is such a good choice to go for. Thirdly, I have this Banana Loose Powder from Insight Professional. Now, I have chosen a banana powder. But if you are somebody who would like to go for a face powder, I think it will cost you much, much less than what this cost. So this costed me around 195 rupees. And if you go for any detail, and face powder it will cost you around 120 to 150 and you can definitely opt it for it really well i am amazed at the way this works on my skin i have been loving this and i'm just fan of this one now i can definitely say that this has done a great job on my skin now, third up is concealer now in this concealer box i actually have you know two concealers rather one concealer and one color corrector and i ensure to get both of them just in case you're a person who has hyperpigmentation you would need an orange color corrector and if you are somebody who just needs a concealer, you can use this one. And just in case, you know, you're not using a color corrector, orange color corrector, what you can do is you can buy a lighter shade of highlighter just to highlight the points on your face. Now, that is totally optional, but each of these costed me 195 rupees. And I just feel an orange color corrector is a very essential part of your makeup. So you should definitely, definitely, definitely go for it. Now, let's move to our eyes for some time so to start with i got this brow pencil this brow pencil costed me 49 rupees this comes from swiss beauty and it comes with a spoolie at the end this is such a good one it is in the color black because i have a lot of brown brow pencil so i went for black but if you're somebody who's just starting off with makeup you can definitely consider buying a brown one because it gives much more subtle and natural look and ensure that you're not going harsh with your brow pencil just draw lightly and it will give you such a good look next up is something that i have become a fan of that and that is this swiss beauty mascara this is the one i am actually uh, wearing it right now and most of the products here are on my face at the moment this costed me 254 rupees and it is worth every bit this actually gives such a volume and length to my eyelashes. I mean, I'm not sure if that's very clearly visible on the camera, but oh my God, I love it. And I love Swiss Beauty as a brand altogether. Next I have with myself is this eyeliner from Swiss Beauty, which is Jet Black Liquid Long Lasting Eyeliner. 
this eyeliner does the decent job i think you know it stays on for long and it is something that i might not buy again but i'm absolutely happy with the price that i paid for this and this came for for 170 rupees i mean that's such a good deal next up is a makeup fixer i mean it was such a big deal to get all these things you know at just 2000 rupees but i somehow managed it and that i got you the swiss beauty fixer natural this comes with aloe vera and vitamin e this is such a good fixer i mean this is my fourth or fifth bottle so this is not something new but for the sake of this kit i bought it and i had already ran out of it so it meant a lot of sense to me and this works very nicely the only problem is it has a hint of smell and and it's kind of strong so you might want to compromise on something you know it's like itne paise mein itna hi milega but this does the job really really well and i don't mind the smell so i'm very much okay with this one now next up is my favorite product from the lot i mean this product was such a worth for money because it has a lot of utility and that is this swiss beauty ultra professional palette this ultra professional palette has so much to offer i mean this palette not just has eye shadows but it also offers you highlighter brush and contour i mean what else could you ask for i'm not sure how this is capturing on the camera but it comes with six delightful colors for your eye shadow a very good color for your blush contour and highlight i have used this so so very much and it works absolutely wonderful the only problem is that the blush has a little bit of glitter which i am not very fan of but it is not chunky you can definitely use it even on daily basis the the eye shadow that has over here you know these are really party wear and these are glittery in nature these are not matte but it also comes with you know one or two colors that can be used daily without any regret this palette just costed me 359 rupees and i mean in 359 rupees i have so many things to use and i absolutely like going for sustainable makeup because that makes more sense to me i am not somebody you know who's going to spend a lot of money on different products rather i would like to use my makeup products in different ways to increase its shelf life so i think this is a good option and also guys the blush as well as the uh, contour in this palette can be easily used as an eye shadow so you can use it in multiple Now coming ways. to lipstick i think guys lipstick is not something that can be included within 2000 because you know lipsticks i don't think you would want to stick with just one lipstick because one lipstick wouldn't go with all your outfits so you might want to you know slow down and buy one at a time and make a collectible so i'm not including lipstick in this entire kit however i want to mention that i got a free lipstick from inside cosmetics uh, while i was buying this on nykaa and the shade is not really something that i'm going to wear but uh, you know i think it was it was such a great experience that i was trying to build a kit and i got a lipstick so this is a pink uh, lipstick which i don't think i'm going to use but i am grateful that i got this one this completes my kit and it came for absolutely 0 rupees so one product that is missing from this kit is kajal i could not you know include kajal in this video because i was really tight on budget and if i had to leave out one thing uh, you know i thought that kajal would be one now just in case you are a person who's not going to use orange color corrector what you can do is you can leave out orange color corrector and buy a good kajal in place of that and you will still have the entire kit ready for yourself in case you know um, you are not a liner person what you can do is you can replace the liner with a kajal because you're more of a kajal person and you can use the black color from your eye shadow palette with micellar water and create uh, eyeliners whenever you want so the idea behind what i'm talking here is that you have to have to be sustainable in terms of your makeup usage you cannot you know continue buying products every month what you have is the best and you should make the best out both these brands are easy on pocket and come with great quality i have used this for 2 to 3 weeks and i can tell you from my own experience that you will never regret creating a kit from these products 
just in case you have any other alternatives to the products that i have used please do not forget to mention that down in the comment box i would love to learn about your recommendations i hope you guys like this video if you did do not forget to hit the like button put a comment down and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching i'll see you again bye bye